what is up guys it is Archelon here I'm going to make this super quick video to hopefully help you guys understand uh, G-Sync it's in the title and I'm going to try to educate some of you on how that works if you're having issues on that um, I used educate that's a little too stern but hopefully you understand what I'm trying to say um, so G-Sync it's supposed to help your game run at a similar refresh rate to your monitor and if it drops below a certain point, it's supposed to calibrate the game so you don't notice the tearing, it's a lot more smooth, and there's a reduced input lag. However, um, seeing as I just made the switch to a 3440 by 1440p monitor, you're going to notice that in a lot of these monitors that have G-Sync, the game doesn't ne necessarily respond well to the increased frames per second. So what you're going to want to do is toggle the options like i'm about to show you here in your nvidia control panel and then you're also going to want to go into your game depending on if it's directx 12 or directx 11 and change the settings accordingly so i'm gonna try to explain this pretty fast and in a hurry so you understand what i'm talking about so when you pull up your nvidia control panel you're going to want to go down to setup g-sync and you're going to want to toggle the enable G-Sync versus G-Sync compatibility. Um, I have it set to windowed and full screen mode. Some people just have it set to full screen mode. The reason why I have it set to windowed and full screen is because in windowed and full screen mode, it takes into account DirectX 12 and DirectX 11. DirectX 12 doesn't really have a dedicated full screen mode. And what you find is because of how it's coded to more directly take advantage of your graphics card it's based on the third party um producer or developer of the video game to decide what gets allocated where and what gets used by the graphics card so a lot of those games very rarely will you find a dedicated full screen mode on a direct x 12 title so you're going to want to set this to enable windowed and full screen mode and it will apply g-sync to all games that would ordinarily just run in windowed as well as games that will run in full screen this is very important the next thing you're going to want to do is depending on what game you're playing and how old the title is uh some games like uh ion a really really old game that i play won't work if you don't do this extra step so the extra step is to go into your 3d settings scroll down to the bottom and where it says vertical sync you're going to want to click on this and go to on or fast pretty much forcing the game whichever game it may be to run at the exact same refresh rate as your monitor you can also go into program settings right here and you can select the game directly from there if you want and um force it to use vertical sync if it's easier that way you don't have to mess with the global settings that's pretty much the basis of everything uh, i'm trying to be really quick with this video so i don't take too much of your time and then when you go back into the game uh, you should hopefully notice that there's a reduced input lag as well as the game just looks a lot smoother there's no tearing or anything like that um, for certain titles like the game i'm playing right now final fantasy 14 you don't have to do this step most games will have um an in-game uh system config where you can scroll all the way down to this issue right here the refresh rate or the frame rate and you can cap it to one to one with the refresh rate of the monitor or you can do like one one half or one fourth and you can have it set so it's always a step in line with the refresh rate which is essentially vertical sync for most cases i could be wrong you can sound off in the comments if i am and correct me but from what I understand, this is essentially the same as vertical sync, so you don't have to mess with the um, the control panel for N NVIDIA. So that pretty much sums it up. Again, remember to go into your control panel, set up G-Sync to be in both windowed and full screen, go back into the game that you're running, see if there's a way to cap the refresh rate or, ver or turn on vertical sync so it corresponds with G-Sync, and if not, then force it as a global setting or by setting on the uh individual game itself and yeah that should wrap up this video thanks for watching if it was helpful please let me know i haven't uploaded a video in a while and uh, leave some comments and just let me know what you liked about it what you didn't like and i'll catch you guys later